Now, amid rising gun violence in the United States, Democrats and Republicans are yet to make a bipartisan decision on gun laws. Our next report has more on this. House will come to order. As mass shootings continue in the United States, Democratic and Republican negotiators in the U.S. Senate are not able to reach a bipartisan response. But both sides have vowed to continue their efforts. to protect them and their loved ones from gun violence. Who among us will answer their call? A group of lawmakers led by Democratic Senator Chris Murphy and Republican Senator John Cornyn are trying to iron out a plan. The plan is supposed to ramp up security at schools in the U.S. Democratic-controlled House of Representatives has voted to approve a sweeping gun control package. But so far, the legislation stands no chance of clearance in the Senate, as it is evenly divided between Democrats and Republicans. leave our children as sitting ducks in gun-free zones when they go to school every day. Sure Republicans That's defend gun ownership rights under yes, the Second Amendment of the U.S. Constitution. Senators are considering relatively modest changes. Some of the changes include keeping guns away from criminals and individuals who pose a danger to the public, tightening background checks for people from 18 to 21 years of age. This would be by encouraging states to make juvenile records available to national databases, notifying local police for failed background checks giving authorities additional time to verify a would-be gun buyer's records when necessary. The expansion of community-based mental health facilities. This is to address underlying problems that could contribute to gun violence. The proposal also includes enhancing the physical security for schools, like more on-campus security officers. The U.S. President, Joe Biden, has also called for new limits to gun ownership. He has urged for a ban on semi-automatic assault-style rifles and high-capacity magazines. Lawmakers hope to reach an agreement by the end of the week, but now it appears less likely. A new round of talks are planned to take place virtually. Senator Murphy plans to pass legislation before the Senate breaks for the 4th of July holiday. Bureau Report, Weon, World is One.